A mother's questions after a Baltimore County officer shoots and kills a man on Interstate 83. His mother has concerns about the violent encounter. Hello, everybody. I'm Denise Koch. And I'm Vic Carter. This unfolded last night on Interstate 83 in Sparks Glencoe. Now, police say they pulled over the man, identified as 48-year-old Eric Sopp, and at some point, an officer shot him. WJZ investigator Mike Helgren is live. He spoke to Sopp's mother, and he has some new information from police. Mike? Denise and Vic, his mom says he did not have a weapon. Police put out a statement within the past 45 minutes. They say the man was threatening himself and others, but they have yet to detail exactly what happened at that moment during the traffic stop when the officer fired his service weapon. He threatened himself with a ice pick, but no indication he actually took it with him. Baltimore County Police are investigating why an officer opened fire and killed a man on Interstate 83 in Sparks Glencoe Tuesday night. The man's mother tells WJZ he suffered from mental health issues and was suicidal at her home not far away. She showed me this cell phone she says her son broke. She says he threatened to kill himself with this ice pick. She tried to take his car keys, but he managed to get them and drive off. She called 911. A short time later, an officer shot him between the Mount Carmel and Belfast Road exits. The mother, who asked the WJZ not show her face, questions why police had to use lethal force. She does not believe her son was armed. My son was not in a good mental frame of mind. And I called 911 as missing, and I thought it was very important that they immediately get out there and look for him and his car. They came to my home and responded quickly. And he couldn't have gotten very far because he only gone to, got to Belfast Road. I don't know what transpired there. I think the situation should have been handled differently. If they needed to, to protect themselves, they could have used a taser gun or shot him in a place that was not vital. So what they really did was kill my son, and I am not happy at all with those that outcome. The entire incident unfolded in less than 10 minutes, according to police audio dispatches we obtained. Shot fired, shot fired. Subject is in a passenger uh, on the driver's side. Four. Okay, how many shots were fired also? Doing the safe side, possibly five. Take it on his condition, make sure there's no weapons under him. And Sop's mother says he was a father of two. Police say their condolences go out to the family, that they are conducting a thorough investigation that will be reviewed by the state's attorney's office. They say the officer is on routine administrative leave. Reporting live, Mike Helgren, WJZ.